All right, this video is gonna be uh, focused on an alternative. If you guys have to have big wrenches, two inch, inch and three eighths, inch and five sixteenths, inch and a half. I mean, this is a four way wrench, but then you got your regular wrenches. So, you know, there's an alternative. If you're just a beginner, if you don't wanna go out and if you don't wanna spend a thousand dollars or more than a thousand to get these big wrenches, there's an alternative. So let's see what that alternative is. So as you can see, we have a two inch, inch and a half, uh, inch and seven sixteenths, inch and three eighths, uh, inch and three sixteenths or 30 millimeter, inch and a quarter, inch and five eighths, uh, inch and five sixteenths, inch and an eighth. Those are the most common sizes for heavy equipment. Or for some reason, if you're messing with some stuff that takes big wrenches, you know, there's an alternative. And it's pretty simple. It's these. Uh, this particular brand is actually made by Grip. Uh, it used to be sold at Northern Tools. I don't know if you can still get it. Under $100. I've had these for over 20 years, and they've held on. You go all the way from an inch and a sixteenth all the way to two inch. Uh, you know, so what's the advantage? One, you can put it on a long ratchet, a short ratchet, uh, to get into different positions. You can put it in an extension. You can uh, actually get into a lot of awkward places wrenches can't get into. Uh, <clears throat> like in excavators, the swivel motors are hard to get at. With these, it makes it a whole lot, a whole lot easier to get in there. Uh, also, you can, uh, if you have a really good, a really good ratchet, like a eighty-eight tooth or seventy-eight tooth, you can really position this thing so you can do your micro turning and. Funny thing about big sockets, especially once you get over inch and a inch and a quarter, once you break them loose, you can take them off by your hand. I mean, it seems that way. You know, the hydraulic hoses. Once you break them, you can take them off by your hand. Uh, other things, uh, bolts. I think nuts are the ones that you might have to keep it on there, but you know, it is what it is. So don't forget, you can get from inch and a sixteenth all the way to two inch in an inexpensive set. I think I'm pretty sure it's under hundred dollars, or they still are. And uh, I did break one; I had to replace it with a snap-on, but that was because I put a three-quarter gun with an adapter on it, and I said it. Uh, I just did what I wasn't supposed to do because I was frustrated. But anyway, neither here nor there. That is the video of the day. Thank you for watching. Leave a comment, and again, this is for the guys that are don't want to go out and spend a ton of money for wrenches.